take our minds off it. How do you feel? Okay. Yeah, it's exactly the same. Good morning. We're out here exploring Amsterdam today. Um, yesterday was a bit rainy, so we just sort of had a chill day and got our bearings of the place. And um, today we're sort of following a bit of Google. Um, I've just got a heap of screenshots. I'm taking Braden on like a DIY tour. We started the morning with Dutch pancakes, which were delicious. I think we'll go back and have them again, yeah? And then we went to the Basilica of St. Nicholas, which is a an old Roman Catholic church. Um, it's very gothic on the outside, beautiful on the inside. We took some footage there. The first stop is going to be um, an old gothic looking church. It's a Roman Catholic church called uh, the Basilica of St. Nicholas. And it opens soon, so we're going to go inside and have a look. We just went to the sex museum, which was very strange and odd. We didn't take any footage there because it was really weird. But I think somewhere that you have to check out when you're here in Amsterdam. But right now we're in um, Dam Square and it's beautiful here. It's just surrounded by all these old buildings and churches and um, lots of little streets uh, for shopping. But it's really pretty. People do bubbles and um, horse and carriage rides and stuff around here, but I think we're going to go to the next place, yeah? Oh, and I should comment on my hair. Braden cut it last night. I don't really know how it looks right now, <laughs> but we did a whole different video on that, so you'll have to watch that if you want to know the story. Where are we going now? Um, I don't know, maybe the canals and stuff? Maybe we'll go on a canal tour? Oh yeah, we're going to go on a boat, aren't we? Yeah, it's been like on and off raining. So we've been a bit slack with the cameras, like we don't want them to get wet, so we put them away. It's really hard to take them out, so sorry about the lack of Amsterdam footage. But we'll get them what we can. Welcome back to Kate's monologues. This street is crooked. Well, the buildings are crooked. I don't know, this is why lens isn't really doing it any justice. Crooked, crooked. So many pigeons. Look at them all. They're flying away. Oh, they just come at you. Oh, <laughs> oh I literally thought it was going to hit me on the head. So we're about to jump on a canal tour. We just came to the little area called Broken and we're just finding any tour. We don't mind which one. Um, that's the boat that I think we're going to jump on. And it costs 12 euros each, which is about 40 Australian dollars. It goes for an hour, so we're really keen. We're getting on a canal tour. Window seat. During the trip, we'll tell you about the most important sites along the route. It's hard to believe that it was once a real river with a rapid current. Seven bridges in a row. This whole time I've been wondering why, like, if you look at the top of these buildings, whole first fact, 
they got taxed on how wide the buildings were. That's why they're all so narrow. Here. Now this whole time I've been wondering why they will have this like solid beam coming out of tip. So I thought it was like for shop owners. I thought that they hang their signs there. But no, it's because all the houses were so narrow and deep. All the furniture, instead of going up the stairs, they took everything through the windows. So the beams that come out the top, they would use to hoist up and down all the furniture. To your left, very nice. You can swing over the edge if you want. Very nice. Maybe a little bit cold today, but we have a nice view. jumped off the canal tour and that was really good. It was very informative, had lots of facts, went nice and slow through all the canals, under all the bridges. We saw, I feel like, a lot of things, hey? We had like the back corner of the boat to ourselves, which was cool. Well, one of my favorite facts is, um, Brad and I were wondering why a lot of the houses are like built, like slanted forward. Um, and it's because, they're so skinny, people can't bring their furniture in and out. So what they do is they actually hoist all their furniture like up the side of the house through the windows. So that's why they built them on a slant. And it also apparently keeps the rain out. And the other fact that I liked was back in the day, they built like the railings along the canals um, to stop cars driving into the water, but it, they still have um, at least one car a week drive into the canal, so it didn't really stop the cars. But we learnt lots of facts. Didn't we, Brayden? Anyway, we're gonna go to the next site now. So we decided to come back to Central Station because the sun's out and um, catch a ferry over to the I Amsterdam sign and um, check that out because yeah, it's something that you have to see, yeah. So we've got to catch a ferry because we're staying in like central Amsterdam and there's like a big body of water, like a river between central of Amsterdam and the sign. So we're following the signs in central. I don't know if this is free. Oh, press the button. And we're off. Ready. Oh, I think we're already here. That was quick. Hopefully we're in the right spot. Yeah. I'm really confused. I don't see it, like, potentially anywhere. So, if you put I Amsterdam in Google Maps, it doesn't bring you to the sign, it brings you to this weird place. That's definitely not it. I think it's near the airport. Which, so we won't be seeing that today. Nah. Or at all.
our first coffee shop. Coffee shop. And I'm really nervous because I've never done it before. So I don't know what's going to happen. We've been advised to halve it and halve it again. Because you never know. So that's what I'm going to do. How do you feel? Okay. Yeah, it's exactly the same. Let's go and do it. Okay. Okay, so we went into a coffee shop. It was really like a weird vibe in there. Wasn't it, Braden? Yeah. Everyone was just silently like doing their thing. Um, but we ordered one spice cake and we had maybe like a quarter each. And I feel perfectly fine right now. We had it about 10 minutes ago. So we're gonna go have a drink, take our minds off it. I didn't feel me now. Like, it was, it was just rolling joints and we were just like, one space cake, please. <laughs> yeah, we were like, we felt like such losers. Yeah, because you had, I think you had more than me. Like, I had, I don't know, you just broke it into like half and then I just half, a little bit more than half of that and then I just like downed it. And you were like, oh, this much? Oh, a bit more? <laughs> like, mine had a definite taste to it, whereas yours didn't, but I chewed mine and you didn't. Yeah, I didn't chew it like at all. Yeah, I just yeah. went like... I like digested mine. Yeah, because I was, yeah, I was ready to leave. Yeah, anyway. maybe find like a coffee shop with a better vibe. That was sort of like an awkward Starbucks or something. Yeah, that was like, um, it's the super busiest one. It's across the road from the... From the it's Central near the Basilica Station. Church. Yeah. yeah, near like Central Station. Yeah. It's the, it's the busiest one I've seen. Yeah. yeah it's Definitely the busiest one. So that's why we chose it because we're like, maybe it's good here. But anyway, oh, yeah, we're, um, soon enough. we're venturing along this street. It's, um, I think we're in Dam. It's called Dam. Yeah, it's just there, yeah. Um, yeah, I think Dam Square is up here. And all the shopping streets are like down here. Um, but we're gonna go to Roken again because we saw heaps of cool bars there. Um, we might catch the tram. Should we catch the tram? I feel like we need to use our tram money though. Okay, bye. What happened? No, it's not happening again. The wave hasn't hit yet, Braden. It's okay. What you what do I you thought want? you were giving this to me. You're just trying to make me look stupid now. No, direct us to where we're going. Where are we going? The red lights. We're at Manny Kenfus. Voted number one French fries. There's always so many people here. We got a packet earlier today with just um, ketchup. But this one's way better. It's truffle mayo. And we actually put sauce on them this time. And they're heaps fresher, aren't they? Yeah, they're heaps good. So take with you a thousand kisses. St. Nicholas, this is a good ruin, isn't it? We are in Amsterdam. Okay, no. Are you going? Oh, I can't really zoom with these gloves on either. Uh oh. The autofocus doesn't work. This autofocus is awful. There we go. Next thing. Doing a photo I've done I've had like a million shots. Okay. This is a T 
terrible place to do this. Hey, we just need to stand to still. Just dropped a ripper. What? What does it smell like? Weed. 